For those of us with iPhones, iPads, and Mac, your Apple ID is basically your most important digital account. If compromised, bad actors can access your iCloud information, see your location, or outright steal your devices from you. While code-based two-factor authentication has been Apple's go-to way to protect your account for years, with iOS 16.3, you can use physical security keys to lock up your Apple ID from would-be intruders. It's the best way to protect your account. In short, a security key is a small piece of hardware resembling a USB thumb drive that can be used to authenticate yourself when signing into an account or device. Once set up, you can use a security key as an alternate form of two-factor authentication. Rather than rely on an SMS code or an authenticator app to prove your identity, you connect your security key to your device to authenticate instead. Now, if someone wants to break into your account, they need access to your physical security key to do so, which greatly reduces the chances you'll be hacked. Apple being Apple, there are some quirks to this process. To start, you'll need to maintain two FIDO certified security keys at all times if you want to use the feature, because Apple doesn't want you to be locked out of your account if you lose one. There are also some limitations to which devices and services you can use these keys with, so it might not work for everything. While any FIDO certified security key should work, Apple highlights three it thinks work best with its devices, including the YubiKey 5C NFC, YubiKey 5CI, and the Phytan ePass K9 NFC USB-A. That's a mouthful. Keep in mind the connector type of the security key. NFC keys, for example, will work wirelessly with all iPhones. USB-C keys will work great with newer Macs and iPads, but older iPhones and older iPads will need a lightning key in order to connect directly. Otherwise, you'll need an adapter to get them working. That's probably why Apple recommends the YubiKey 5C NFC first since its NFC connectivity will work with your iPhone and its USB-C port will connect to many Macs and iPads. Apple makes things relatively simple to set up. You'll find it on your iPhone or iPad from Settings, Passwords and Security, then Add Security Keys. And on a Mac from System Preferences, Your Name, Password and Security, then click Add next to Security Keys. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned to Lifehacker for more tips and tricks on doing everything better.